Yo, what is up you guys? So today, <clears throat> excuse me, I just fucking woke up. I'm gonna be doing a long awaited sort of update video on how to apply tape. Today, we on broke boy status. Not really, that doesn't exist, but I do have, I've been telling y'all for a while, especially if you follow me on Instagram, the tag is gonna be somewhere. In one of these corners over here, I told y'all that I've been rocking with the Target tape for a while now. So this is what it looks like. I've been up, right? So I already had a package open. This is what it looks like, comes in a regular case. And I'm just gonna be showing you guys, like literally showing you guys how I apply my tape. Don't get too excited because I'm obviously not going to do like a chest reveal or anything like that. I'm just going to cover the small amount of fat that I do have. I have a bunch of people DMing me and reaching out to me on here and they're like, Devin, like, can you break it down a little bit more? So that's what I'm going to do. It's been over a year, two, two, over two years since that one video, especially since my chest is more built. I'll offer you guys a little bit more assistance in that department and kind of help you out. For me. Before we get into that, if you are new here, new as in not subscribe, go ahead and fucking hit the, the subscribe. That's the like button, Devin. Go ahead and hit that button that says subscribe, support me. If you just think I'm like handsome, hit the subscribe and the like button. At this point, you gotta do what you gotta do. All right, here we go. You're gonna wanna have nipple covers, right? So these are simply like my girlfriend, like makeup pads that you take your makeup off with. Can you tell that I'm a man? I have no idea. I'm not even trying to like play it up. I think these are like makeup wipe cover offers, right? But these are like the areola type of, this is a perfect circle, okay? So it should, it should work just fine. I don't really do this anymore. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. My nipples are not like going through hell or anything like that. They don't become attached to the tape like how you think they would, so I don't do this anymore. But simply for today, I'm gonna do it for you guys. It'll help me be able to actually show you the tutorial a little bit easier. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. While I'm doing this, a lot of y'all have asked me before, when I take the tape off, does it feel like my skin is being ripped off by 100 demons? So on and so forth. And the answer to that is no. It used to tear my skin off a little bit, right? And the key to not tearing your skin off is to leave the tape on for long enough that it becomes worn out. This is almost like a chest reveal, but not really. And depending on like your chest is different, everybody's chest is different. This is all pec, all muscle, all muscle. And the fat begins around here, right? So this this is where I begin taping. It serves no purpose to tape where you have pet. There's no point to, to, to tape muscle down because that's already formed or regular. You know what I mean, chest, so there's no need to tape it down. Wherever your pec stops, and the fat begins, that's where you're gonna wanna begin taping. Here we go. And the big key I'm gonna show you guys in a second is to wrap it around. So I wrap it around my lat, and that way it is offering support. If your pec starts low enough, you can wear tank tops without showing off the taping because it'll be fine. We get this right here. Only need to grab about that much of it. So this is where the fat for me begins, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and grab it, pull it, and this is what's offering that support. Pull it. And at this point, you're steadily releasing it. And you wanna make sure it's flush with your skin, like it's all even. As you pull the tape from the elastic, you're pushing it forward with this hand. And then I pull it forward from there, boom. At this point, I only need to use two pieces of tape. So that's what I do, obviously, to grab that bottom bit right there. And like I said, I don't really cover my nipples anymore, but I love y'all and I wanna show y'all the proper way to do. That's how it looks on my back. Like really hurt my back and I haven't been able to train like 150%. So it's been really agitating me. Like I look in the mirror and I just feel like I look fat. I know I'm not making gains simply because I'm not training. So it was kind of hard for me to make this video for y'all. So I'm gonna keep it transparent with you guys. I do have the ring light in here and I am finding the best fucking angle possible. So it still looks like I have some semblance of abs. It still looks like I'm somewhat gained, like have some gains, but everybody feels like shit every once in a while. And then you're gonna grab this plastic part right here and use this hand to push this part forward and this hand to pull it back. Boom. There you go. Bring it all the way back. And then just make sure that it's flat on your back. If this part right here is like crumbled up or it's rolled over or it's just something not flush on your back, it's gonna begin to roll throughout the week and it's not, you're not gonna get the proper wear out of it. So definitely keep that in mind. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the other side. And like I said, like if your fat starts in different places, if your fat starts higher up, you'll need to do it from higher up. If your fat starts, hey, if your chest is even better than mine, then you might need to even start lower. It just, you have to play around with it and find what works for you. The whole point is to have that fat tucked away. Put it where the fat starts, which is right about there. And then pull it on over. Boom. Pulling it over. And then, ah, my back, fuck me, uh. It just really hurts to stretch my back, like the right side, fuck. Um, make sure it's all smooth back here, so when you start another one, it's not gonna be overlapped on top of something that's not properly placed. Okay, get it for the bottom, and pull it, pull it, pull it, boom, boom, boom. 
keep it going. Make sure it's nice and flush, ouch. And that's how it looks from the back. And you see it's low enough. Most tank tops go to about like here, I guess. So it ends up looking fine. I'll show you guys right now. Okay, so boom. As you can see, you can't see anything. It's ironic, here's from the back. So it is low enough. You can't see anything. Obviously this here makes me dysphoric. Uh, so it depends on if I'm having, depends on having, if I'm having a good day or not, if I'll wear a tank top, something because of this little part. And everybody I talk to, they're like, Devin, you're being dramatic. You're being a drama king. Nobody can see anything. It's all in your head. And I don't know if you guys are seeing what I'm seeing, but it looks like you can see something, okay? So that is it. This is the final product. So you don't need, in my opinion, and this is not to Dirty Mac, any other brand. Um, I'm simply always gonna keep it real with y'all in terms of like financially, accessibility, shit like that. And I'm sure trans tape works for some people. Honestly, guys, this was $5. Got it at Target. Walmart also has regular KT tape. Financially, from an economical standpoint, I wear tape every fucking day. $5 compared to $14.99, $12.99, XYZ is always gonna be better, superior in my opinion. It's fucking tape. It's all doing the same thing, in my opinion, at the end of the day. So go with whatever you want to it's all up to you whether or not it works for you definitely depends on your chest size like i said before i used to be a large sports bra obviously training my ass off training my ass off has gotten my chest to where it's at a little bit of special sauces here and there and like i said before i feel really kind of crappy about my physique lately but um this is where we're at right now this is what it looks like I showed you guys what it looks like with the shirt on play around with it if you do have a larger chest i'm not entirely sure if it would be cis passing it's whatever the fuck i really don't care boom hopefully this is way more helpful than the other one that i made if it was helpful at this point if you have left a like and a subscribe for me it's cool i'll see you next video that is the video hopefully you did find it helpful if you are interested on one-on-one -on -one personal training meal plans or training plans hit my business email devin does coaching at gmail.com in the description below follow me on instagram i post more content there very fucking often it's really cool to interface with you guys on there as well if you fuck with my glasses y'all already know hit the link in the description below firmu.com to get 50 percent off use my code dvm50 at checkout it helps me out with that commission aspect and then also the glasses are extremely affordable already keep in mind the frames are the frames and the lenses are included in the total price that you see there you have prescription sunglasses blue light glasses for if you're like me always editing all the fucking time like i always say guys that is the video i hope you appreciate it i hope you found it helpful like i always say devin loves you devin's a don and devin is out of here boy ah.